Oh my god, I forgot to do a thumbnail and it's too late. Look at this. Oh my god. I've basically eaten my thumbnail. Well, how's it people? So, oh wait, just a disclaimer. This is not the cooking video with my mother. Uh, that one's still coming. Hold your horses. Today, you know, since it's like minus 17 million degrees outside. Honestly, look outside. Oh, you can't see outside. But it just looks terrible, okay? I thought, you know what would hit the spot right now? One luck! Mutton bunny, that's what would hit the spot, right? Well, it would hit my spot. <laughs> uh, so, that is what we are doing today. This is kind of weird. Like, if you've been following me for a long time, you, you'll know that I've made a lot of cooking videos on my channel. But this is the first time that I'm doing a cooking video in my own actual original home. It's kind of weird. I feel very out of place. Like I feel like I have to have my Korean apartment behind me. This is weird. There, like that. Oh no, what is that light? Ugh! That's better! Filming things! Listen, firstly, if you don't know what a bunny chow is, if you remember correctly, one of the cooking videos that I did was a, a, a chicken bunny video. I actually made a chicken bunny in Korea. And I'm, I really hope, I can't remember that video at all, but I really hope I explain what a bunny chow is in that video. So I'll put the thumbnail over there. No, over there. No, over there. I'll put that video over there. Go watch that if you want to know what a bunny chow is and then come back to this video but you promise to come back to this video also i'm not going to show you like how to make the mutton curry there's like a million and seven mutton curry recipes online this video is just about me making that bunny chow the process of putting it in the bread that's the most fun part of this video but you can see over here okay. Those are all my sp the spices and things that I'm using. Yeah! What we have to go through to make one mutton curry. This Tamil life, I tell you. Put one stick there, put one leaf there, put some onions there, put more leaves there, put some seeds there, put one star there. If I were a spice, it would be the star one. Speaking of which, it reminds me, <laughs> I don't, I think it was like grade six or something, I don't know, prize giving. And I was raking up all the awards because uh, I'm Indian. And uh, this one lady, she turns to my mother and she's like, You know, your daughter's gonna be such a star in the future, hey? Oh, if only that lady knew that I spent 10 years of my life bumming about in Asia. Put some manja there. Oh, too much manja. Oh, you Elaichi is so disgusting. Mutton masala. This is literally called mutton masala, guys. Oh wow. One ton ginger garlic, one ton salt. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. Also, look at this color! Yes! Oh yeah, I think that is looking pretty good. And that smell smells like Durban XA. Eh? Are you even Indian if you don't bang the pot seven times? Alright, let's get the mutton. Can you just get off my way, please? Thank you. Who is the most famous sheep in the world? Steve Mutton. <laughs> I made that joke up, you know. Okay, I'll stop. Okay, but why did Prishen uh, choose a mutton bunny over a mutton biryani? Because it was sheep. <laughs> Get it because like cheap but cheap <laughs> okay i'll stop jeez but sam you should be a stand-up comedian you know honestly i thought about it but seriously i think i'll be too bad at it <laughs> okay bye hey lucka put one two petitos in there i told you the story of the petito thing uh, my family, they still give me hell about it, but apparently when I was... Well, not apparently, I've seen it for myself on my home videos. Uh, but like when I was three or four, I don't know, 
um, I couldn't say potato, I could only pronounce it as petito. I know it was a real lol, you had to be there. But you'll be happy to know that uh, I have since learned how to pronounce potato. Hey, this is looking tops, man. Wait, let me show you, let me show you, let me show you. Check it, check it, check it, check it. Yeah, luckers, I told you. You didn't want to believe me? You know what? <laughs> I seem to have forgotten that I'm only cooking for myself. <laughs> Love those cavemen. Oh, I should probably warn you, my nose is running today. Uh, so just excuse my nose if ever you hear it every now and then. Like who even needs the Tokyo Olympics when you have the Farm Olympics right here? And my nose has already won a gold medal for South Africa. <laughs> my jokes are so good, I know. You don't even have to tell me. But listen, anyway. The mutton is looking amazing, but I have to leave it now for like two hours or something because you know how mutton is. So I'll catch you in about two hours time. I'm gonna go charge my battery in the meantime because listen, please remind me in the comments to buy another battery for my camera because this is ridiculous. We're like, I only have one battery. So every now and then I have to go and charge it. Like what kind of YouTuber am I? Yo! Ta-da! Oh my god! Look at that! But Sam, you ready for your arranged marriage? Hey, that's my joke, don't steal it. No, but seriously, I'm ready for my arranged marriage. That's amazing. I think that's the best I've cooked ever. Okay, now for the fun part. <laughs> so aggressive oh my gosh <sighs> now let me tell you something I have brown bread <laughs> um, a top tip if you're trying to make a bunny chow do not ever 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 don't ever 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 under any circumstances use brown bread <laughs> but basically what happened was I went to pick and pay and I asked the lady for unsliced white bread and she was like I only have brown bread and I was like Ugh. and then my dad was like don't worry let's go to spa and I was like I don't have patience to go to spa just give me the bread spa is right next door to Big Bay and I have no patience for that I know I'm working on my patience okay yeah so I have brown bread it'll be fine it'll be fine at least I'll be healthy the question is do I want a half bunny or a quarter bunny sorry I have to bring you back to the bread board <laughs> can't cut it on that plate. There we go. Now we are talking. Can you just focus on the bread, please? Camera, hello? Hello? Ooh! Wait, I like the side better. No, I like the side better. Yeah, let's do this side. Okay, let's do this much. This brown bread is killing my soul. I'm trying to cut this and look in the camera at the same time to see if it's focusing. Oh my God. Go. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. All right, now for the really fun part. Oh my gosh, this mutton curry is looking even better. Look at this. Oh my god. Now, let's get some meat. Oh, I've got two motor bones. Okay. So let's pull it up. Half a petito. Let's get more meat in there. <gasps> what the hell? I'm so good sometimes. Let's put more there. Oh, no, no, I don't want these leaves. No, leaf. Leave me alone. <laughs> I want the gravy to like. Yes, like that. Oh, look at us. I'm just looking at it on the camera. Oh my. And you know what's really annoying is my parents are not even here and they can't even see my expertise. Is that enough? Is it focused? Are you not focusing on my bunny? Oh, thank you. I cannot believe this whole time it wasn't focusing. Look at this. What? I need to keep some gravy for when I have some with rice because 
You can't beat rice at the end of the day. I'm terrible, leave me alone. It's a bloody masterpiece. But you know what this needs? This needs some carrot salad. Should I put it on top? Yeah, put it on top. Anyway, it's too late now. <gasps> And then what I'll do is I'll put this on top. Yeah. Okay, listen. <laughs> I mean, presentation is minus one out of ten. Wait, no, that's a terrible view. Okay, look at it. You know why? Because this thing, this, the inside of the bread is too fat. That's why. It looked better without it. Wait, let me take it off, actually. Let me put it on the side. It's too much. Mmm. There we go. Sorry, I'm just tasting it. Oh my gosh, it's so good. There we go. That looks better. I mean, it doesn't. <laughs> there we go. Let's do a mukbang while we're at it. I don't even want to eat this. Like, it's a, it just, it look, I, I, like this belongs in a museum, in the mutton bunny museum. It's just too perfect to eat. You know, wait, hang on. Let's get some meat. Yeah. You know what's crazy? Wait, let me just taste this. It's so good. <laughs> Maybe I should start making bunnies. Well, this video turned into a mukbang very quickly, hey? Welcome to my mutton curry bunny mukbang. But no lies, this is legit. I'm so proud of myself. Like, I did this. Me. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, I forgot to take a picture to show my parents. Mm -hmm. The carrot salad. I'm gonna say something quite controversial now. I hope you're ready. But I actually always, always, from the time I was small, I always prefer um, a chicken bunny <laughs> to a mutton bunny. Ah, that is hot. A mutton bunny is like mutton curry is amazing, and a mutton bunny is amazing, right? But I think it's because we grew up. There's never mutton in our house when we were small. Never mutton. Even now, never mutton. And there's just because my parents don't eat meat, and we never like we. My older sister and I, my younger sister is vegetarian. Um, but my older sister and I, we never like fussed about it. There was no mutton in the house and we just like left it. <laughs> like, we were okay with that. So we were totally okay with just eating chicken. Yeah, so I think because of that, I just always gravitate towards chicken, anything. Chicken biryani, chicken bunny, anything. But because I eat mutton so rarely, when I do eat a mutton bunny or a mutton curry, it's like... It just hits the spot, you know? If I place your bed... Am I gonna finish this or not? Place your bits now, kids. Also, it's actually quite good with the um, with brown bread. It's like it doesn't make any difference at all. Hey, did I mention that I made this? I don't think I did. I made this. Oh, the house is so nice and peaceful. I was actually supposed to go with them, but at the last minute, I decided that I needed some uh, some me time. You know when they say three's a crowd? Uh, yeah, it's very, very, very crowded. Um, so I think I needed some time today for myself. So I said, I'm sorry. You know what happened? So I never used to, let me just finish. I never used to eat with my mouth full because obviously it's bad manners, right? But because of Korea, I became okay with it. Like it's totally, totally, totally okay to eat with your mouth full in Korea. Like <laughs> no one bats an eyelid. And now I sometimes don't realize that I'm doing it and I need to stop. I've started exercising. Are you proud of me? Come on, tell me in the comments how proud you are of me. I'm trying to tone my arms. And also I'm just like trying to just do some exercises first thing in the morning. You know what? Like you always just go and buy a mutton, a bunny, right? You never ever think about like making it for yourself at home. Like who makes, does anyone make bunnies at home for themselves? It's just like, it's just something, I don't know. Is it just me? But actually, it's just as easy. Like you make the curry, 
and then you cut up the bread and put it in. Like it's just it's the same thing. It's something that you always go and buy. You know? Okay, let me go then. Let me eat this in peace. I can't have so many of you putting eyes on my bunny. I'm gonna get a stomach ache just now. Before I go, you better go and tell me how proud you are that I did this because I obviously need your validation. Obviously. Let me know which bunny you prefer, chicken or a mutton. Let's get this engagement going, guys. Tell me, what do you prefer? Have you noticed how I'm not even putting beans bunny in that? I don't care. Okay, let me go then. Don't forget if you like the video, give it a like. If you didn't like the video, give it a like anyway. Don't forget to follow me on all the social media. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to join my channel. And I will see you next time with a new video. Goodbye.